you know, I have posted this video uh, more than two video now that I posted the same topic. Listen, they know that you are going to be great. Listen, there are a lot of people who have spiritual evil eyes. As I'm just like, like this place now, as you are just passing by, they will view you and know what you are going to become. Yes. And that is when they will start to fight you. You know, a lot of people who are now in difficult time, who are in hardship, who are passing, you know, stages in life, you need to hear this video particularly. You know, there is one of my uh, friends, you know, he was just passing the way, you know, the way I'm just passing like this. Then a little daughter in his own house, sitting, you know, near road, the man just called, you know, this my friend. He said, uh, come, 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 come. Uh, do you know that in time to come, and now it's like, let me say, uh, getting to 15 years now, that I'm, this thing happened, or let me say 10 years. He said, do you know that in time to come, you are going to be great? Do you know that in time to come, you are going to, you know, drive a car, you are going to drive a lot of things? So this, my friend, we are so what? We are so shocked and what? And surprised. Then, then he was so shocked and what? And surprised. Then after everything, uh, it was like, uh, why are you saying this? Then after some some hours, they have this you know discussion. You know he was just speaking with the guy. Then he said the word. He said that is the reason why you don't do what you don't respect nobody. <laughs> That is the reason why you don't respect nobody. Because uh, maybe you know that in time to come, you are going to be greater than us. You are going to be more successful than us. You are going to drive car. And, and even in that, you are not going to live in Nigeria at all. You are not going to live in Africa. <laughs> this, my friend, was so shocked. He said, what kind of... What are you... Why? <laughs> you know, when something shocks you, you will not even have any word to respond. You will just be what? Silent. So he, he was shocked with word. So that's why I'm here to tell you, a lot of people who are fighting you know accurately what you are going to become and where you are going to be in time to come. That's why they keep fighting you. They keep talking bad of you. They keep treating you like nobody. They, they keep trying to cost, you know, hard time. They, put, they keep trying to put hard time or you know makes things difficult with their evil manipulation listen there are a lot of people who will stand and start to make evil incantation to make life become so hard but before you reach your what you're going to see if you will be able to reach that place but the truth is that they know that you are going to be great one certain day they know that in time to come you are going to sit with kings and queens they know that in time to come you are going to sit with men that matters you know what i'm saying so that is why many of them will start to fight you Angles one place to another. That's why if I see some people who said I'm tired of life, I feel like waiting. Uh, you know, one thing I, uh, I first of all asked: huh? If these people know where they are going to be in time to come, they will never have this mindset to do or to quit. So the truth is this: you are what you are going to be great, and majority of them truly do or truly know what. And whom you are going to be. And that is why many of them will suddenly, you know, start to talk bad of you, manipulate you, say all manners of words to make life become what so misery. When I mean so misery, in order for you to be what to be feeling less of yourself, so that you will not be able to do what to do some certain things that you ought to do or to do. So <laughs> The truth is this. <laughs> Child. So the truth is that you are going to be great. And truly they know it. And they will never, never allow you to get to that place easily. You know what I'm saying? They will never, never allow you to go to that place easily. Why? Because they are so jealous, envy, and what and what malice have already corrupted their, what, their mind. So you are going to be great, bro. And majority of evil people hate us, frustrate us. People who have evil spiritual eyes knows it. That is why they will keep what trying to manipulate you, trying to make life become what, like frustrating you, not you frustrating your enemies. You know what I'm saying? So many people will start to act all this way in order for them to corrupt that which God have given to you. That is why, listen, when God said to Ezekiel, He said, "Before you were born, I have already knew." How do you think that God knew? 
he, 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 he comes to remind him what he has already deposited inside him. So that is the same way many people will do what many people will come to remind you. The moment they see you, they will come to remind you what God has already deposited in you, which have not yet been exposed to you. <laughs> hey God. That is why when Jabez was born, Jabez was full of what? Of the moment, the, moment, the moment he was born, that is when pain, sorrow began. But he get to a point where he grew. He, the things that happened to his what, brothers, sisters, uncles, ancestors, he was revealed to him. He discovered it within himself that this is what a lot of people have passed through in my what in my days. Then he decided to pray, say, God, change my life. When Jacob realized what was going on within him, nothing was working around him. He, he discovered that there's something that follow his name. He discovered that there's something that do, that, that go with his name. That's when, when the angel, you know, the, 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 the thing is this, uh, within myself, and all I thought is that that is not the first time that the angels have visited with Jacob. There have been many years, many days that the angel, because a Jewish stranger cannot just come to your house and you hold him and say, I will never let you go. It will look funny. Maybe the angels have been coming regularly and he come to realize this is this is my name. Since I was given this name, nothing is happening. I, he come to discover that there's something that goes with his name that he need to realize. That's why he said, angel, you must change my name. So my brothers, a lot of people know whom you exactly are. A lot of people know that there's something in you that even if it takes you like 5 to 10 years, you must surely be in a position, even if you are suffering right now, even if you are, you are passing some, some, what, some process down, even if you are not yet married, even if you are single now, that a time is coming where your marriage, your, your, your business, your, your, what life, your life will be the talk of town. That is why they keep fighting you every day. That is why I always urge you, by the power bestowed upon Apostle Paul, that is the reason why I always urge you by the grace of what of choosing by the unit of trinity never you quit your dream never you surrender don't just don't just look at me yes i know i'm too little to say this word i know that i'm too little to plead but by for the sake of people around you just for the sake of your what your niece your nephews your brothers your sisters your auntie for the sake of people who depend on you never you quit your dream because there's a great vision ahead for you to accomplish god did not just bring you into this world to live and go just like that he bring you into to this world to accomplish that which he have deposited inside you and most of people whom you think that they are telling you you can't do it and you are still going with them most of people whom you you flesh around with you don't know that many of them are demotion into your life to weaken you and to stop you from not achieving your you need to cut off some people in order for you to go far brothers they truly know that you are going to be great and on another way is that they are going to send many of them will be sending some people into your life in order for them to delay it yes in order for them to delay it <laughs> you know what i'm saying so be careful whom you follow because a lot of people whom you follow may do, do what may delay the calling of god in your life so remember this. so the truth is this many people who know that you are going to be great that is why they do envy you too much they know that you are going to be successful they know that you are going to be unique they know that there's something in you that will change the world that will change your family that will rewrite your history around you and many of them know that you are going to be the first to break some record and that is exactly the reason why they do or they truly envy you you know what i'm saying so never you look look, look what lose hope and never you think of quitting. If you think of anything, I plead by the blood of Jesus to tell you how serious I am. Never you quit or never you tried of quitting. You know what I'm saying? Quitting is never an option. Because if you succeed tomorrow, I'm sure one day we will meet like, you know, as I'm passing, you know, I, I, I always like, you know, passing around. Even if I travel, I, I come to your country, maybe one day I will just come to your country to do campaign or to do, um, you know, revival on it or ETC. 
Uh, you may see me and say, ah, you small okay, K-boy. Uh, I'll just say, ah, you did that. <laughs> you say, yes, yes, yes. You see your boy. Uh, I can remember that your small teaching. Uh, when you do used to open your teeth, when you, you when, when, when you, you do used to drink Coca-Cola and all those, you come say, I will still reply to you. You know what I'm saying? Then when I see that, uh, I'll say, God, glory be to you, not to me. So never you quit your dream. So keep what? Keep grinding and keep succeeding because God want you to be great, what successful not a loser you know what i'm saying so never we disappoint what ourselves you know what i'm saying be great remember blessed